I like the Razer Keo Pro more than the Elgato face cam. Now, Elgato, please know I love all of your other products. I just couldn't jive with the face cam. Here's why. Okay, so a few years ago, uh, when I was really getting more consistent with streaming, I got my first Twitch payout and I was like, hey, here's some extra money. This is great. My first payout, it was a good size payout. I was very blessed by my community, by my chat. But I, I did a lot of research. I was using like this old handy cam going through an uh, Elgato cam link and it just, it didn't look like I wanted it to look. I wanted to be able to mess with the settings more than I could and tweak it more than I could and every time I do something on the camera I then have to come into OBS and adjust in OBS and I wanted it to really just be able to adjust it all in one place. I did a lot of research I watched a lot of YouTube videos and comparisons of the Elgato face cam and the Razer Keo Pro they both I think came out around the same time uh, at the time I was looking they're both about the same price but ultimately I, I opted to go with the Keo Pro now I've always wanted to try out the face cam so I had a few uh, extra bucks laying around from, from a gift card and some different freelance things I've been doing. So I decided to invest in a face cam. I'm sending it back though, because it just, I just couldn't get it to look the way I want it to look. So the Razer Keo Pro, um, when you go into OBS and I'm gonna overlay it right here, uh, when you go into OBS, you can actually adjust a lot more settings in the Keo Pro than you can in the face cam. Um, one of the things I found is uh, just the lighting on the Keo Pro is a little bit more balanced. The lighting sensors on the face cam seem to really absorb light a lot better, but with similar settings to my Razer Keo Pro, and I know you can't compare camera to camera, it's like Nikon to Canon or Sony or whatever. I tried to match them up and I just couldn't get them to align perfectly where each image looked the same. Now in fairness, I use a LUT on my Keo Pro, so I tried to apply the same uh, LUT to my face cam and it just, it looked, it looked worse. I just couldn't get them to line up. So uh, one of the things so that the face cam had that I really, really, really enjoyed is the frame rate on the face cam looks so much smoother than the Keo Pro. Now I run 60 frames when I record videos, when I stream any of that, and some people say, why do you do that? That's a blah, 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 I, because it looks good. Like that's it. I did notice the face cam, it looked a lot more lifelike, a lot more realistic than it does with the Keo Pro. But what's the point of a nice smooth frame rate if the image looks like crap? So I really did though try to uh, balance out the face cam. The other thing I found too is it really taxed my machine. Now in fairness, I'm running in uh, a, a, an ASRock uh, RX 5500 XT, okay? So I'm not like top of the line graphics card. Um, but I did find that even with the face cam running on its own and my, my Keo Pro unplugged, it just, it was slow. It was laggy. Frames were dropping like crazy. Uh, so it just, the, as far as performance wise, I wasn't totally impressed with it either. And I, I love Razer products as well. I'm actually using a Sonosa Chroma. This was actually right here, this keyboard. I should do another video on that. This keyboard was my first investment when I was planning to get a gaming PC. I wanted an RGB keyboard and I made a spur of the moment target purchase. Uh, I've also got a Kraken keyboard that I use for gaming. And then I've got a few other keyboards on my bookshelf back here. But anyway, face cam versus Keo Pro. <sighs> Keo Pro wins, but I'm curious to hear what webcam you use. Drop a comment below, working on some more um, review of, of tech, of equipment, things I have. I have some things on my desk that I really want to review in a future video. So if there's something you'd love to know more about, something you see in my image here, leave a comment. Would love to have conversation. And honestly, if there's a comment that really blows my mind, I would be willing to engage in uh, more conversation or even throw another video together. But anyway, hey, that's it. Razer Keo Pro. I'm sorry, Elgato. I love you. Please don't ever exclude me from anything. Maybe you send me a free face cam once I return this one and say hey here are the settings you need to use anyway Elgato I do love you I love the stream deck I love my key light air I love my cam link 4k I love it all except the face cam